an Amazon affiliate marketing tutorial for complete beginners and something you could try today to make your first $100 a day online. I think something that most people don't understand is a lot of ways to go out and make money online, especially with like Amazon affiliate marketing is based off of your personality. Like if you are someone that likes showing your face on camera, someone that likes putting yourself out there on social media, great. There's a way to go ahead and make money with Amazon affiliate marketing. If you're someone that's introverted and shy and not tech savvy and you don't want to go ahead and make content, you don't want to put yourself out there, guess what? There is a way to go ahead and for example, make money with Amazon affiliate marketing. The problem with most people is they don't understand that your personality will dictate your personal reality. If your personality is introverted, do something that makes money with introversions. Or if you're someone that wants to go in and create content, put yourself out there, you wanna go ahead and build a present, guess what? Use that. What most people fail to go to understand with Amazon affiliate marketing is they don't do things that aren't aligned with who they are as individuals. So I guess the first step before we understand anything is finding out what do you wanna do? Do you wanna show your face on camera or do you not wanna show your face on camera? And that was a question that I asked for me because if you literally go ahead and look around, there's people that don't show their face on camera. Look at this, by Sophia Lee. This girl just literally created a blog when she was like literally in college and you can see with Amazon affiliate marketing, she made three grand in a single month, okay? If she was able to do this as a college student, what's stopping you? If you were able to go out and make $100 a day with Amazon affiliate marketing, what's stopping you? Which, as you can see with no experience whatsoever, I was able to pull in $346,000 in net commissions. So how do we actually begin with this? Well, the first step is understanding well, what products you actually wanna go out and sell, right? So obviously, I have Amazon right here. And if you're wondering, well, Mike, I have an Amazon account. How do I go out and make money with this? Before you do anything, you wanna go out and sign up for what is known as Amazon slash program.amazon.com because it's free to get started. And what I do is if I see anything that I wanna go ahead and sell, like say for example, a grill, right? Say this grill. If I wanna sell this grill, all I have to do is this thing will pop up if you are signed into, for example, Amazon Associates. Or if you literally go ahead and click on that, it will give you a special link. If I send anyone to this special link and someone goes and buys anything in Amazon, Guess what, I get paid. Here's an example of this. I remember I was trying to be an Amazon affiliate for my own book. So I wrote a book several years ago, right? And you can see, ooh, look at my book on Kindle and on paperback book. So as you can see, like I literally wrote a book. And the thing about this book is, I was like, oh, I can make money from this book. But if I recommend people to this book, then if they buy anything on Amazon, I get paid. So I remember, so I grabbed this link. I recommended it to people. I was like, guys, go through this link. And I remember someone came in, did it by the book, bought a grill, like in an expensive grill, it's like a thousand bucks. I remember getting like a huge commission, a huge commission just because I sent someone to Amazon, right? So the beauty about Amazon affiliate marketing is whoever you send to Amazon, they don't even have to buy the product that it is that you're recommending. They will literally essentially go ahead and give you commissions for anything that it is that you buy. This is exactly how this is why I'm broke a simple blog that's just sending everyone to, for example, Amazon products. If you literally go ahead and look at any one of these things, a lot of these people, they literally just go ahead and recommend, like for example, Amazon, like if I click on this, bam, that's an Amazon affiliate link, right? If they buy this or anything else, that is the reason why these people make $20,000 per month with Amazon affiliate marketing. So you can see that it's pretty ridiculous. So how would I go ahead and do this? Well, once you actually sign up for Amazon Associates and you actually go ahead and wanna go ahead and sell things, what do you actually go to do? Well, it's very simple. Look around your home. What can I actually recommend? I can recommend this lamp. I can recommend this chair. I can recommend these lights. I could recommend this obnoxiously sized teddy bear. Maybe this guitar, maybe this table thingy, maybe this TV, maybe this thing that I don't know what it's called. Whatever I have already purchased that's already in my house, that is like the easiest thing to create content because I could go ahead and create my own pictures, I could go ahead and make my own videos, it doesn't matter. And what I would do is I would literally go ahead and do that. So it's like, if I'm gonna go ahead and say like cameras, I see this camera right now, obviously, because I'm talking to it. If I wanted to go ahead and make a camera and say I wanted to go ahead and get like, for example, this exact same camera, it's like, uh, GH5, right? And I've literally recommended this to so many people because they're like, Mike, what is the camera that you use? And I'm like, oh, you gotta get what I got, right? And I'll literally grab this, grab this text thing. So now I have a special link. So guess what I do with this special link? I create content about it. But you're probably wondering, well, Mike, what content do I create about this? Well, it's very simple. What are people already gonna search for where they're gonna wanna buy this? Are they gonna be like, how to use a camera? No, they're probably gonna write things like, best camera for. The reason why I know this is because like, think about this, if me and you went on a date or me and you went and we went somewhere and we were hungry and we went to a new city, say we went to like, for example, I don't know, Toronto, we went to Canada. I don't know why, but say we're there, okay? And I've never been in Toronto, you've never been in Toronto, and we want to get the best hamburger. So what do we, what do, we do? Do we Google how to bake a ha hamburger? No, 
we Google what is the best hamburger in Toronto. And when we go out and do that, our intention is to give someone money, not to do a tutorial, but to give someone money. So if that's the case, what are the keywords that we should create content about? Well, probably the same thing. If I go to Pinterest, this is a place where I literally get a bunch of views to all of my blog articles so that I could go ahead and make money with my commissions in affiliate marketing. I would type in best uh, camera. You see all of these things that pop up? I would literally go ahead and use this and turn this into a title. I would turn this into a blog article. I would make YouTube videos about it and start, you know, sending more people here. I can do the exact same with YouTube. Type this in best camera. Look at this, best camera for photography, for vlogging, for YouTube. Any one of these things, if I go ahead and like click on any one of the stuff, what you will actually see is in the description, many of these people are recommending to Amazon. Look at this, US prices, Lumix H5. And they're actually, look at this, boom. If I go ahead and now buy anything from here, this person will get a lot of commissions because this is just a high ticket offer. Does that make sense? But obviously if you don't wanna make YouTube videos and you just wanna find out how Cam was able to make zero to $20,000 a month with no experience, then I highly recommend you check out the brand new silver lining method to making 10 grand a month profit with just a smartphone in as little as, as eight weeks that you can sign up for it in the free link in the link below. But yeah, that's literally what I would go ahead and do. I would literally go ahead and take the most expensive things that were already in my vicinity. I was like, what content can I create? Do I wanna show my face on camera? Or do I not wanna show my face on camera? Either way, you could actually go out and do it. So let's actually break down both. If I didn't wanna show my face on camera, what would I do? I would create a blog by going to mikevaseal.com forward slash money blog, and I would literally see what people would go ahead and wanna buy. Say if I had a bunch of cameras, I would literally go ahead and write that. So let's just say I would create a Pinterest account, and I would create a blog article for best camera for cameras for photography for beginners. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on that and let's see exactly how people are making money. So look at this, let's open photo jeepers, 307 shares. Right, so all these people are like, oh my God, let me go ahead and get this camera from photo jeepers. And look at this, they're recommending Amazon, they're recommending Amazon, they're recommending Amazon. Look at this, you could go ahead and buy this on Amazon. Check prices on Amazon, right? Anytime you go ahead and click on this, guess what, they're making affiliate commissions. So I would go ahead and write this blog article. But you're probably wondering, well, Mike, I'm not a good blog person. Well, I can grab this title, go to ChatGPT, be like, yo, AI robot, write me a 1,000 word article on the, boop, the 10 best cameras for beginners. Boom. So I literally wrote that. And this artificial intelligence is now creating me. Look at this. Oh, I could get an affiliate link for this. I could get an affiliate link for that. I can, look, look, look at this, I can grab that, let's go. Oops, oh, it's moving too fast. I can't copy it. Fujifilm, oh, okay, let's go ahead and try that. So, so I can go ahead and type in the Fujifilm thing. Here's this mirrorless thing. I can go ahead and grab the text, bam. Grab this text, copy and paste this. And when I turn this into a blog article, I will just literally go ahead and paste it in that link. Does that make sense? So once I have that blog article, throw it up on my blog, what am I gonna go ahead and do next? Well, what I'm gonna go ahead and do next is I'm gonna create a Pinterest. So you can see that this thing was literally created from, for example, Pinterest. You can literally sign up for Pinterest for free. And uh, like you can see I've made like my pinnable things that are not really that pretty, but for some reason, the less pretty they are on Pinterest, the better it is that they actually go ahead and do. And you can see that I've made like just a bunch of pins. Look at all these pins that I made on Pinterest. And essentially what I would do is I would pin my blog up on Pinterest with the 10 best cameras for beginners with this picture. And in the blog, what I would do is whenever someone clicks on any one of these links, like how someone clicks on this and they go to affiliate program where I'm recommending, for example, Bluehost, right? It's the exact same thing where every single time someone clicks on one of these things, they're gonna go to one of my affiliate links that I recommend from Amazon. And that's it. I would literally just create a bunch of content like that on blogging. Now, if I wanted to show my face on camera, what I would do is do the exact same thing, but with, you know, for example, my face. I would t literally read this out loud, make a YouTube video about it, be like, yo guys, you wanna find out the 10 best cameras that you could start for beginners. Look, they even made me a title of the YouTube video. I'm just gonna go ahead and read these. Hey guys, you can check out the Canon one. The Canon's like really cool because it has an excellent entry level DSLR that offers a seamless transition and you know, I'm just like, I'm just creating content out. Like do you see, like if I was gonna turn this into a video, I was like, hey guys, so 
Let me go ahead and recommend you the, the, the top cameras for complete beginners. Well, obviously the Canon EOS Rebel T7i EOS 800D is something that you can go ahead and use with seamless integration to the entry level DSLR that offers a seamless transition. Like, do you see how easy it is? Like I could just go ahead and create content and I just don't even have to be the smartest person in the world. I just have to go ahead and put myself out there. But if you're like Mike, I don't wanna put myself out there. I wanna do exactly what Cam did to go ahead and make zero to $20,000 a month in a very short amount of time. Then you can literally figure out how he did with this brand new method by going to mikethesteel.com forward slash free workshop or seeing how we use the brand new silver lining method to make 3K to 10K a month profit. There's money in your bank account. In as little as eight weeks, sign up for it in the free workshop below and book a call with me and my team if you wanna go ahead and help you.